I want, and I know Anna wants the same thing. For you to take that tracksuit off? We want this to work, okay. right? You had the first date night, mm -hmm. right? How things go on the date? Really well, yeah. And we just had a laugh. Like, we honestly just had fun together. It was just so nice. Seems like we've got some progress. <laughs> this is good. The vibes are good. Body language is good. You're not interrupting each other when you talk. There's physical touch. This is good. <laughs> so guess what? You're going to go on another date when you get home. You know, you could think of this as a date, but you could also just think of this as we're just going home to have quality time together. Yeah. When you're at home, we want you to go around to all the rooms. All right, Peter, where's this going? Because I'm sure in all the rooms in your, in your house, you've had arguments, right? And the rest. Ugh. So the idea is you want to walk into those rooms, recollect those disagreements and those arguments, and then you basically want to just say, look, we're, we're getting rid of these. It's done. This is a new space. This is a safe space. Any questions, then, about tonight? No, we're happy. We're excited. Can't wait. Yeah. I'm excited, aren't we? Let's get home. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so excited. Chuffing hell, I'm so excited. My nipples are like pebbles. If Charlotte and Mac put their negativity to bed, it'll enable far more positivity going forward. Lovely right. to see you. Yeah. Nice seeing you, Paul. Good seeing you, man. Good time. Bye, Thanks. darling. Okay, Thank all right, you. take care. Bye-bye. Oh, Bye. <laughs> this date is mainly trying to get the negative energy out of some of the rooms in the house. Obviously, since we bought the house, we've had nothing but drama. Oh, so it's the house's fault, you argue. I remember that one. Let's start the cleansing process. Come on. Come on. Oh, look. Oh, ow, Matthew, you keep standing on my slippers. <laughs> the state of that. Never mind a relationship cleanse. I need a baggage handler to sort that out. Kin hell. So what's the bad energy in here, then? Go on, start with me. Go on, I'm ready for it, come on. Zippy sleeves. <clears throat> Wet towels on the bed. So, yeah, because what happens is I get out of the bath and I want to have a bit of a lie down on the bed. Well, that cleared that up. So one of my main issues with you is the plaster. So obviously you're a yeah. plasterer and you literally come in, you rip your plastering outfit off, you get in bed, but you've still got plaster all over your body. When I get into bed at night, I can feel clumps of stuff in the bed. I think that could be the suitcases. I'll accept that and I apologise yes, for so that. Yes, so there smell. is a lot of plaster, as you can see. Right. Surprised you can see anything under that lot. This is the worst thing ever for me. I hate this. Who clamps their bike inside? Must be a world dodgy area. Why would you put your bike in the hallway? Because there's no more room in the bed. We literally spend hardly any time together cos you're on your bike and I'm sat on the stairs eating my chips <laughs> or... Imagine if I had a chip shop in the middle of the hallway. It's like she's pitching a new reality show. The Chipper Queen with her new dream. This is hard to part with, this bike, but I might do it for you. It's a fix us. Do they really? get a fix us? Yeah, because I think we'll spend more time together. I actually can't believe how well this is going. Matt's making compromises for me. Where's the catch? I appreciate it. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye, bitch. Bye-bye, <laughs> bitch. Owl chips. We grab it. Extra large chips. Ah, get in my belly. So nice. Mmm. <laughs> can't reach ya. I'm not sure I want to know which argument this is they're recreating. Yours is better. <laughs> <laughs> what did you think about, um Today, I thought it's been good for us. I feel like it's really cleansed our souls. Cleansed your what? Mm. Shame we didn't cleanse your bedroom. Oh, for God, why do I always get food on me? I, need a bib. I might lick it. If you want to get your head down that low, you need a rib removing. I've inquired. Tonight's made me remember how well Matt and I both get on when we don't argue. I just hope we can keep the romance going moving forward. Come on. Come on. I can't read them. <laughs> Oh, they're like a couple of randy seagulls. <laughs>